Hi everybody, today we're showing you another lovely pen and what we have here is a Schaefer Snorkel Saratoga. Now, I've shown you numerous um, snorkel pens on my channel but I don't think I've shown you the Saratoga so I thought it'd be nice to uh, make a video on this particular pen. This is, as we said, the Snorkel. Um, it comes in this classic black and the pen is actually made in Australia. If we show you the the barrel imprint there you'll notice it says made in Australia um, and then it says I think it's WA Schaefer Pen Company and then it, I think it has the pat number underneath to the end of the barrel there you can see the the filler knob there to the end which will show you it working in a moment and if we take you to the to the top of the pen the cap there you can see it's got this large gold filled cap band there and the very recognisable Schaefer uh, clip to the top there with the word Schaefer's on the clip itself. Um, you'll notice this particular model is the non-white dot model so it doesn't actually have the the white dot as some of the um, Schaefer snorkels have. Um, as I say this is the, the, the Saratoga um, as I said, made in Australia, approximately around about 1950s. These these pens, this this one is actually, as you can see, is a classic black, and they brought them out in lots of different colours. Um, burgundy. Uh, there was a pastel grey, blue, and a green. Um, there was also what they termed as a buckskin tan colour, vermilion. Um, I think last but not least, they also brought out a sage green, but. As I say, what we have here is the the classic black. If we unscrew the cap for you there, give you a little bit of a twirl, show you the pen and the cap in different angles. To the top of the barrel there, you see it's got this metal uh, cap thread. You've got this um, slightly serrated section there, which, which gives you a nice grip. And the main thing on this particular pen, being the Saratoga, what you'll notice... Um, it has this open um, open nib if you like and it's actually a Schaefer's Australia 14 karat gold nib with what they term as a platinum mask to the top there okay so whereas some of these Schaefer snorkels had the the conical nibs if you like this particular model is recognizable by this open nib and if we turn it round there you can see it's got the feed underneath there and as we'll show you in a moment we've got the snorkel um, inside the feed. This pen we've actually serviced so what you actually do is actually if we unscrew the the knob to the end of the barrel there you can actually see the snorkel actually coming out of the um, out of the feed and we wait until we hear that distinctive click and if I just show you the the nib and the snorkel there. Another thing you may recognise on this particular model you'll see the snorkel has quite a flat end as opposed to some of the uh, the other snorkels which come to uh, a distinctive point. Um, as with all the snorkel pens how we fill is we just simply push down on the filler tube there. In fact what we'll do as I say I've serviced it so it's as good time as any to actually uh, test the pen. So what we do, we dip the snorkel into the ink and just simply push down on the filler tube. Okay, I don't know if you could actually hear that. Lots of lovely bubbling, which indicates to us that everything seems quite, quite fine. And then what we do now, we just simply turn the knob to the end there and you can see the snorkel retracts back into back into the feed okay so what we'll do now is bring on our little pad and let's have a try at writing so what we have is a a Schaefer and again this is the uh, the snorkel and as we said before, this particular model is the Sarah Saratoga. Okay, we date the pen in the region of the 1950s. 
this particular pen is writing with a lovely uh, a lovely fine line there's no variation in the nib there's no flexibility um, quite a nice smooth writer but as we said a lovely lovely fine line okay so let's show you the the writing sample lovely writer nice fine line and then what we actually do to actually empty empty the pen is we undo this snorkel just if I can do it just bear with me a second oh sorry I've actually forgotten how to use it myself now so what we do we unscrew the snorkel like so pull out the um, the tube and if I just be a bit careful there we go <laughs> what I've actually done is you can't see it but just to the side here I've squirted all over my white my white background which wasn't recommended um, the reason for that being again I don't know if you can actually see it we'll keep it nice and still what you'll see in the the snorkel tube is on each sides there there's actually two little two little holes if you like I'm going to keep it nice and still we'll rotate it slightly there's two little holes to the side of the snorkel tube and then very to the very top there there's a slight slit in the tube as well so as I pressed it down the ink actually squirted out out of the two out of the two holes okay so let's screw that back in let's screw the snorkel back home pop the cap back on and there we have it let's keep it nice and brief I hope you've enjoyed looking at the pen um, as much as I've enjoyed you um, showing it to you don't forget I've got lots more videos don't be shy go and have a look but for now I'll just say bye bye now